Today is the 5th of February 2011 and the IEC has been pushing for everyone to go out and register to vote. So have you registered to vote? Is your vote going to make a difference? Do you think that your vote can actually change anything? Welcome to I Believe TV, the show that takes the mystery out of the effects and techniques that the government and media use to keep you in the dark. My name is Justin Ballett and today I'm going to be speaking about voting. Now a wise man once said to me that if voting could change anything it would be illegal and I believe that to be true. You see, voting has never changed anything. Take a look at the black people of South Africa. Did they vote to change the laws from apartheid to the current system? No. Did gays vote in order to have rights? Did women vote in order to have rights? Right now in Egypt we have a situation where the people of Egypt are protesting and rebelling against the current system, but they're not voting to get out the current president, they're rebelling. You see, the only way in which to change law is to rebel. It's to rebel against the government, to make it impossible for that system to work. The politicians keep making promises about greater employment and housing. Yet you notice that 30 million people are still living, living below the poverty breadline in South Africa, and they're still living in shacks. And the only organizations that are actually hiring anybody are the criminal ones. Politicians make promises, but never deliver on those promises. And once in power, there's no way, there's no system in place to ensure delivery from what they've promised. And there's no accountability if they do not deliver on those promises. So if your vote does not count, then what is the reason for voting? Well, what you're actually voting for is a system of debt, which keeps them, the government, rich and in power. That's what you're actually voting for. Politicians go to the international bankers to borrow money. They then put you down as the guarantors to pay off that money while they put all of that money into their back pockets. By voting for government, you are voting for the misappropriation of funds. You are voting for the rigged tenders. You are voting in agreement of the police just going around indiscriminately shooting people. You are voting for everything that you have. You're not voting for change. You are voting in agreement. It's a contract that you have agreed to the way in which you have been treated. You have agreed to the higher taxes. You have agreed to the toll roads. You have agreed to everything that the government's done to you. But if you believe in voting, that's your choice. I cannot do your thinking and reasoning for you. You have to use your own brains and show me when a government's made a promise and they've actually delivered on that promise. Besides delivering into their back pockets.